Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to the Swiss Confederacy campaign of Napoleon Total War using Darth Mod. Here we are on the campaign map like usual and if you remember from last time we finally did it, we got rid of the Ottomans, we've taken the Balkans and we now have one, two, three, four, five provinces all down this spine here. And we're looking pretty good. Now I've read some of your comments on the previous couple of videos and a couple of suggestions that I looked at from your comments. Some are saying I should perhaps go to Sicily and try and take some of these Italian states, try and build up another kind of continent or country, I should say, there. Um, that's a possibility. Somebody else said that they'd like me to go east, try and take out some of these Russian provinces. Now, I would be tempted to take out these Russian provinces. Look how many there are, there's loads. All that land could be ours, perhaps. However, I do have some concerns. I do have allies in Austria over here, although I do have allies myself with the French. And my biggest fear would be that I'd, I'd start winning the war here in Russia or, or start doing quite well, perhaps. Take perhaps Bucharest and Istanbul and maybe these provinces here. And as I go further inwards, France declare war on me. The worst thing I want is for France to be at war on me on this side and Russia to be at war on me on this side. So. I'm a little bit in two minds whether to do that or not, but I am definitely thinking about some of these Italian states. We're already, already at war with Sicily and Naples. We're at peace with the Papal States, so I'm thinking perhaps that my best interest may be to try to get some... See, they're allied with Italy, so we will try and get an alliance with the Papal States. They don't want that, okay. Um, Your demand, no, I don't want that. Technology. We'll offer them a couple of. We'll offer them that, okay? So we got a new ally now in the Papal States. That's the first thing that I wanted because I'd like to be at war with these two, with them helping, and the French. So I have two allies now. Sardinia is at peace with me as well, so maybe it might be in my best interest to try and get some peace with Sardinia. They're not that keen on me at the moment, to be fair. However, they haven't got any kind of, they haven't got any allies. We could perhaps take Sardinia out ourselves. Um, they haven't got any technology. I'll tell you what, we'll leave them for now. We've got an alliance with the Papal States. That's the first thing. We're also allied with Italy and we're also allied with France. France got to war with Italy, we can pounce with these two regions. France got to war with Württemberg, we pounce with this region. We have two large armies here in the Balkans. The one which took Belgrade. I should actually repair that. We've got half a stack. And we've got some cobble roads as well to begin with. Now this force is going to be my main force that goes into Italy. We're going to get them to my commercial port. Take them three turns. That's fine. We're going to go and try to take Naples first. Now the problem with uh, this is that they may have a full stack army. People have suggested this to me and I have seen it before. I had a Greece campaign that I did in my own time but a year ago when I was Greece. I had taken most of this region and parts of Russia and I thought, you know what, I'm going to go here to Sicily and try and take Sicily. I turned up with a reasonable force, probably like the one I've got now. I landed in Sicily and what happened? They had a full stack army there, they had another army here somewhere and I just didn't stand a chance. So I'm going to be a bit more cautious this time in this campaign. So this army, these guys are going to have to recruit some units for me as well. The Venice, oh, I'm going to turn. But then turn, we we'll see what happens this end turn phase. But that's the general idea. So we'll try and take Italy next. That way I've got two large kind of regions in the kind of Mediterranean region of the continent. Um, I'm just too wary to go to war with Russia because of the whole kind of France wage war on me. I mean, France got a lot of enemies, don't get me wrong, but they're so small, like they're at war with they're at war with Prussia, they've annihilated Prussia in this campaign. They're pushing east on Russia at the moment. They've almost annihilated Austria. I'm surprised Austria is still in the game at the moment to be honest. So there's plenty of um, enemies for the French to deal with themselves. They're at war with Sardinia themselves, I think they're at war with Sicily like I am. Um, but yeah, try and take southern Italy. The Papal States, I'm happy to be allies with them at the moment. 
um, may end up going to war with them in the future. Oh, brilliant. We've got an agent in Greece. That's always good. I need agents, actually. Um, where's my other agent? Uh, i got two agents, haven't I? Right, i got this guy here. He can actually go to the harbour. Because he's going to be my main spy in Italy. The agent I have now over here somewhere, there he is. Bring him up north. I want to know how if Russia plan to attack me, so go to that bridge for now. Um, I do have a navy somewhere, trading somewhere, I think. Yeah. How much are we getting though? 88 coffee supplied to your capital. So it will check. Uh, trade. Uh, it doesn't really say, does it? We're getting quite a bit of income anyway, we're getting 3,000 odd a turn, I think, so... Um, ships. Ships are what we need to get me over there. 64 gun ship will do for now. We'll get a few others uh, shortly. Let's have a quick check of the, of the whole kind of diplomatic relations at the moment. Sardinia, well, they got quite a lot of trade partners, but they got no enemies, no allies. They probably got quite a fair sized army in Sardinia then. But we're not at war with them, so nothing really to worry about at the moment. Sicily and Naples are the two. Now they're allied with Russia, Britain, Naples themselves. Um, I know one suggestion was to get a ceasefire with Austria. They haven't got any technology though. Ah, it's no, it's no point. The suggestion in one of my comments was that then turn that was to do what I did against the Ottomans. Offer them a ceasefire, take all the technology, make it an offer they can't refuse, and then exterminate them. But I don't see the point in that. They got no technology. Uh, I don't think their province, their province is too near Russia for my liking, and too near France as well. Where I'm currently uh, at, I can kind of defend my eastern territories from the bridges. My spy can also look look for me to see if there's any. Russian advance, so I'm not too bothered about that at the moment. I'd like it if the, if Württemberg would uh, go to war against me, though. I wonder if I could provoke them somehow. Because I think Württemberg's a province I gotta actually claim to win this campaign, so they're definitely it's definitely a province I need to take. Um, I'll have a check that now, actually. See what my key provinces are. Let's see, well, we do that objectives here we are uh, as you can see where all the red marks are I've gone all the way east down here and the funniest part about it is that I need to get all these off the French so war with France is inevitable but see Württemberg if I can get Württemberg Tyrol and that but they're all French I don't need that province there ah it's irritating I currently hold five regions, I need twenty altogether. But I gotta get eleven provinces. So I'm gonna have to go into like Germany and parts of Belgium and Holland. It's not good. It's not good at all. Um too early to worry about that anyway. With my get my army into this harbour. Get my spy into the harbour as well. It's gonna take how many turns is it going to take to two turns. I'll get another 64 gun as well. Um, and while that's happening, these guys are replenishing which is good. I can't recruit bugger all though. That's the problem I got. I should probably upgrade some of my ports. Repair some of my ports. This, this one's okay. It's a trading port. But it could be better. It could be a commercial port. Um, I need to check what else I need to repair. This needs to be repaired. Supply post. 440. Uh, <sighs> I'd like to get a ceasefire with Britain, if possible. Hey, that's good. So, Britain are no longer at war with me. The reports. I wish I could get trade with them, though. They got no technology. Well, I'm no longer at war with Britain, so that's good. One less foe to worry about. Russia would be, ni would be nice. Well, 
they're not interested, are they? They got no technology, as the worst pass. Uh, Austria, we know haven't got any technology. Naples, I'm going to attack. Sicily, I'm going to attack. Sweden, don't see the point to be in war with these. They're nowhere near me. They got no technology. No, so we got off to cease fire with Britain. So that's one less foe to worry about. I'm always worried the British might sail along with their ships and annihilate me. So we'll end turn again. Let's see if anything interesting happens now in this part. The good thing is, if Russia do attack, I got two fairly strong forces in Bucharest and in Greece that can sally out and rebuff them. So that's not a worry for me at this moment in time. I definitely, definitely need to try and get Württemberg at war with me somehow and swoop in there and take their province. Got to remember, but the Spanish as well. The Spanish are not really doing much on their side of the map. And they're allied with France as well. It'd be good if France waged war on me and I could get Spain to fight against them. If I can get as many enemies against France, then who knows? But my aim at the moment is to keep expanding. We'll try and take Naples. And there's a Russian army on my border. Interesting. I don't think they're going to attack me though. Be suicidal if they attack me with that army. My force increase is fairly. Oh, actually, I'm going to force increase. Uh oh. Right. Um. Militia, 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 line infantry. Just as I begin with, I thought I had a better force than Greece. My own fault. I'm going to have to repair this yet again. <laughs> okay, it doesn't matter. Let's get these guys in here. Army. Construction, naval recruitment. One more turn. I think I just drop them in Naples for now. That army should be alright. We've got two units of. Um, what are they call? Artillery. We've got two artillery units. So it should be okay. My spy can do some of the work. I might actually drop my spy off first and then see what I can do. Uh, we'll end turn again. Just going right through the end turn phases at the moment. And by the way, check out my, if you haven't checked out my Rome 2 Faction Pro video, let me know who you want me to play as when Rome 2 is released. It's just under two weeks now until it's released. Can't wait for it. And also check out my Rome 2 intro videos, which should be up by the time this video is uploaded. Um, I've released three of them all together. The, one, the, two of them are kind of water effect type of videos. One of them's got like a fire effect, kind of like a... Um, burn of Carthage uh, type of thing so check them out let me know which one you think is the best one and I shall use it in my Rome 2 Let's Play come September the 3rd when it's released so check it out um, but enough of Rome 2 this is Napoleon of course uh oh oh bugger hang on Spanish of wage war Sicilian oh this is I'm sure that looks Spanish to me. Right, we we fight in Sicily by the looks of it. What have they got? They got quite a lot of trade ships actually. They've got mainly trade ships, and I've got mainly trade ships, but I've also got a 38 gun. We will attack and we'll try to defend this trade port. Interesting turn of events. I've got to be wary now if I do embark on an army. I can't afford to lose an army at sea, so I may stay in my port for a few more turns now. But it depends really on the outcome of this battle. My first naval battle, I believe. I'm not sure if I did a naval battle in the first 12 parts. But it's definitely my first in this kind of part of the campaign. So nothing fancy, just get all my ships move in. The start of the battle. Where are they? Oh, they're in a line over there. Bye. Right. You can fight that one. You can fight that one. My main 38 gun can stay there for now. We'll try and take out the front to begin with. I don't like naval battles. I absolutely despise them. Because I'm crap, basically. Um, but we will see how we do in this. They have a lot more ships than me. I've only got 5. They've got about 10, I think. Speed things up slightly because naval battles take forever to fight, as you all know. My ships aren't actually moving. Why aren't they moving? Moving now, not in combat. 
I can't tell if they're moving or not. Oh, I don't know. Set sail. See what I mean? I don't even know what I'm doing. I can sort this out. This might be a long part. But I absolutely despise these battles. Oh, they are moving. It's just me. Yeah, it's just me being a bit frantic. So I'm just going to forward this slightly to get nearer to the to the enemy, the Sicilian ships. Hopefully, we can destroy a few of their ships early on in this battle. Where's their main? Is that their main merchantman? Merchantman trade, trade. They got any trade ship to trade. They're all trade, aren't they? I think they're all trade. If I can take some of these trade ships out straight away, they're looking pretty good. So I'm gonna get this one down ready. I'm just gonna try to attack them with. My sail, my my sail, my broadside. Something I can't wait for for Rome too is the naval battles because they're not as complicated as Napoleon naval battles, of course. So it should be pretty good. All these guys uh, get up there. Need to get nearer. Let's get that sail going. Come on, go fast, my friend. Go fast. They're all in a line, they should be an easy target. But they're all merchantmen, I can't get over that. A whole fleet of trade ships decided to attack me. My 38 guns should make short work of most of them. Maybe I should have auto resolved. I don't know. Let's see what we got. Right. You two go for the first ship. And this one can go for one of the middle ones. This trade ship is doing quite well so far. Increase sail, I want you to go. Oh, see, I hate trade. I just hate naval battles. It's a beautiful image there of my trade ship. I'd actually screenshot this one for my Facebook page. There we are. Nice little screenshot there. I'll take a few more. When you're out on the ocean, nice to enjoy it. Another another screenshot there. Some beautiful screenshots. Um, try another one, I think. Let's zoom out. Nice little shot for there. Just taking loads of screenshots. Enjoying myself on the ocean at the moment, right. Let's get back to the serious business of trying to win this battle. Right, so if he can sally around here, I might be able to get a shot away on this one ship. Zoom in for the kill. When he passes, I'll start the fire. Any time now. Three, two, one, and I think I can go now. Got some shots away. We're just going to travel along this line, shooting at these ships, and the rest of my forces can all fire on this one, and this merchant ship as well. While this ship fires upon all this full line, I should say, of ships. Come on, any time today would be nice. Might miss this first ship now. I have to go for the next one. Maybe not. Here we go, another shot. And we've hit the sail there, I think. A little bit of damage. Try it again. And we are starting to fire now. But these ships get really close. I want more to fire on this one ship. This ship is going to be the bait. While well, I can get a few shots away. On some of these merchantman ships. If there's one thing I'd like to improve on in Total War, it would be naval battles. I am crap. 
naval battles. Three, two, one. Just turn slightly. Here we go. Did I hit? It's just short, I think. I'm a bit out of range. A little bit out of range, I think, for the moment. Let's bring her in slightly. Bring her in slightly. Oh, and look at this. We've got plenty of stuff going on here. I'm going to want to get this trade ship round slowly. That's right. Bring it round. Bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it. Now I think I should fire. Three, two, one, fire. There we go. A little bit of damage done there. Keep attacking that ship. Go with the train shop. Chain shot. Ah, I can't get my words out. Chain shot. Try and take out those sails. That would be great. Where's my 38 gun? My 38 gun's all the way back here. Come on, 3 2 1, 3 2 1. If I can get another shot away on this ship, we'll be doing okay. Right, we'll try it now. Some damage. Right, this guy's in range. 3, 2, 1. He's on. He's in range. A few more shots this side. A little bit more damage again. I think. Not 100% sure. These guys in a lot of trouble here. That's them. A lot of damage to them. This sails right down. Heavily outnumbered in this battle, I gotta be honest with you. Come on. Increase sail. Guy around to get another shot away would be great. Three, two, one, fire. No. Some more shots. A bit more damage. Nice little bit of damage there. And you can go straight for the end ship now, I think. So far, so good, I think. Not really good at these battles, as you all know. I'm kind of shit at them. But I will try my best. Pretty much the same crew as all these ships apart from my 38 gun. That's going to be the key, the 38 gun. Taking forever to reload this side. Look at this, they've arced themselves right around that one ship. Totally going to annihilate my ship. I would try to board a few of these ships as well, but I don't think I'll be able to. Look at the 38 gun doing all the work, but they brilliant work. By the 38 gunship. If we can get a round shot in, would be great. Might be in range shortly. Just arc it slightly. Here we go, 3 to 1, fire. Where are they firing? Tell them I'm going to my own ship. Oh, my ship's in terrible danger. Look at this. I've only got 11 guns left. Fire in range for this ship. I may have to go to the chain shot, I think. Right, he's doing okay. Let's bring it back over here. Bring it back, bring it back, bring it back, bring it back, bring it. I apologize, my singing's probably awful. But here we are, and it's not looking good, is it? hate naval battles. It's... I could lose my whole trade fleet in this one battle. It's probably going to be a one hour special this, this uh, episode because these naval battles take forever. Right, here we go. Fire. Oh, we took took some damage on him there. That's great. Go back to round shot. That's why I'm firing so far away. So far away. Far away for far too long. Again, I apologize. Don't know what's come over me all of a sudden. 
Uh, my 38 gun is going to load. If I can bring him around slightly, bring him around slightly, he'll be in range for this ship over there. Get the red from my ship and fire. Oh, <laughs> nice little shot there. He's going to be the key, the 38 gun. I could try to board. I don't know if that's in my best interest at the moment. Losing slightly, not in com not in combat. How can I not be in combat? Not that one. Then. Bring my ship around slightly. Come on. There we go. Three, two, one. Fire. Beautiful. I have no idea if I'm doing the sort of damage I need to be doing. But I'm going to take that as a guess. He will the fire soon. Come on, keep going, keep going. You can do this. You can do this, I believe. I believe, come on, a bit more. Arc it slightly. Three, two, one, fire. More damage again. You probably noticed that I am kind of saving my... 55... Saving my 30 gun, 38 gun ship for later in the battle. At the moment, he's just back there. The reason for that is because he's going to be the key in this battle. That ship is. Three, two, one, fire! Oh, I don't know if I'm. Hello, what we go over here? Oops. Oh, I thought there was some men swimming. Nice bit of debris there. Nice bit of debris. Always good. I go to the chain shot. Try and take out some of the sails. Thirty-eight gun can fire, fire. Look at all these ships closing on me. <laughs> I'm in so much trouble. Right, fire this now. Fire. A little bit of damage in that ship. Fire. Fire! <laughs> Just hitting everything, throwing everything at them at the moment. Throwing them the kitchen sink, as they say. I think I've taken out a lot of their sails, man. They look. I'm not really sure, but I'm definitely doing some damage to them. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Now, three, two, and one. Fire. Ooh, nice bit of damage there. Oh, my ship's gonna lose by here. My ship's definitely going to lose. Fired on all sides. Bang. Oh, I got three. Swap it to a creep shot. If I can soak up as much pressure as I can this side, then I should be okay. One of our ships is withdrawing oh, from the fight. Here we are. Just so saying it, he's gone. Expected that heavily outnumbered. Didn't stand an absolute chance there, so it doesn't matter though. We still got the ships in this battle. I was hoping I could take one of them out by now. Another fire here. A bit more damage that side. These ships gotta get out of the way, so you can go that way. You can go this way. Oh, wrong side, didn't want that. 38 gun can get a shot away. Let's stay in range, this guy's fire. More damage again to the hull. This trade ship. Fire on that one for me, would be great. I thought I saw one wavering then. I 
through the gunfire. Fire. Boarding. I'm not a bit way about that. Fire. Can't afford to lose this hell. Okay, tell you what, we're gonna board you instead. I have more men on my ship than you, so we'll board you instead. That's one way of doing it. Right. Ignore the ship that's boarding me. Just carry on with this battle. These guys are in serious danger. Fire. Oh, right into them. Shooting at me as well. Come on. Go for a grape shot this time. Day would be great. What do they show me on the screen? I'm not sure. Fire. Great to see that these guys came back to me. Fire. Grape shots for fire. I think if oh, we need my own ship then. How are we doing? We're winning that part of the battle at the moment. Wrong side, the side I wanted. These guys, oh, we've been on fire now. Turn this around. Get my ship out of ring, don't hit my own ship. I need all the ships I can get at the moment. These guys can quickly turn, that'd be great. Come on, keep turning, keep turning, keep turning. Right, I think we're more or less there. Three, two, one, and fire. Go. Some more damage there. These guys. Gotta bring it around. Guys, fire now! I think. Hang on. These guys can fire. And these guys will soon be firing as well. Get the side ready. Fire. One of our ships is withdrawing from the fight. It's another ship we've lost. It's a shame. Didn't want that. Three, two, and one. And we'll soon be able to fire on the ship. Fire, and now. Let's see. They've surrendered to me this side. They did gun. Doing well. Are they back on the ship yet? I don't think they are. Let's get all these guys going. Close to this battle, I think. Got the disadvantage at the moment. Not looking good. Taking all sorts of damage. Click the repair button. Forgot you could repair. Let's get the ship's repairing. 
all of them appear at the moment. <laughs> Go. These guys have appeared. Fire into the ship that's already surrendered, because that's how I roll. And my general's dead, so this battle's pretty much over now. Um, how long will it take to repair these trade ships? Three, two, and one, fire. Just more damage again. Oh god, these guys have routed. Uh, let's board the ship. I'm going to start boarding ships now because I'm really up against it. Gun. It's going to be the key to this battle, like I said. Just get all my marine in. Remaining ships start boarding. Soon fire with side three, two, and one. Oh, not quite. Keep turning, keep turning. Right, fire. There we go, some more damage. Three, two, and one, fire. And these guys are not in combat as well, they can fire on this one, fire. Start boarding. We can board this ship. These guys will come back to me as well. We can board this ship. If we can board a few ships and perhaps win. How are we going here? Concerned the Admiral dead. Not a lot I can do there, I'm afraid. Oops. And fire. Just caught that ship. Most of my ships are bored in now. If we can repair this one again, it'd be great. Come on, turn. Start the turn, you fool, turn. get a shot away on here, help out these guys. I think I can, I'm gonna fire anyway. Hopefully I can hit more, mainly the ship, which I think I have. Are oh, we doing 25 against 19? One of our ships is withdrawing from oh, the fight! Oh, we lost another ship, that's a shame. Pay this ship. Right, so, these guys are gonna have to board. Board the ship. 48 against 52. Numerical advantage our, our way, I think. These guys are boarding this ship. We've actually lost this battle, this side. Not looking good. Hate naval battles. I keep saying it, but I do absolutely hate them. 3, 2, 1, fire. Again, some more damage. They're boarding you this time, I look to it. We've lost this boarding action over here as well. One of our ships is withdrawing from the fight! two ships left now, it's not looking good at all. But we will give it our best shot. Another screenshot for the album, Facebook album. If you guys are interested, check out my Facebook page. I would be putting screenshots of all my battles on there. There we go, nice bit of damage there, look at that. Nice bit of damage. Try it again. What ships have we got left? Uh, these guys are boarding. I, I fear for them. I really do fear for them. And oh, there's my other ship. Here it is. Let's get these going. Not 
looking good at all, is it? Not looking good at all. I've actually lost my 38 gun now. Oh, he's come back. 38 gun's come back. Nice bit of damage. Oh, he's gone again. Right, so he's gone again. Plenty of ships routing. Not many of them routing, though. Right. Don't know what the hell I'm doing. Back again. Fire again. 38 guns holding on. Doing okay so far. Fire in all directions now. All hope is lost, sir. This battle is almost done. And I think that's it, yeah. Here we go. There's the end of the battle feat. Little screenshot there of the battle to finish. Close defeat, unfortunately. And there we are. We have lost our navy by the looks of things. Not good news at all. The only ship we got is our one trade ship. I'll accept that. Oh, oh done. What was the point? Oh, I'm gonna fight this. Auto resolve. We lost, of course. And our navy has been defeated. We no longer have a navy. I'm gonna have to rebuild everything again. That should free up a little bit of money though. No more upkeep for those ships, so uh let's have a quick quick check. Fleet destroyed. Units recruited in Greece. And I have my sixty four gun ship has been uh, built as well. I can, um, right, I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's get all these guys. I can't remember how to do this now. Do I just move the ship? I think I just moved the ship, don't I? No, I don't. Right, so, army to the agent to the and then I want to disembark here but they won't let me do it this turn for some reason don't know why uh, well we stay close to our home province here and um, we recruit in here as well we've got quite a bit of money as well I should actually recruit some more 80 gun ship as well we get but I've been dragon heart I'm gonna end this episode here so to recap we're gonna go for Italy I think Got to rebuild this navy and some of our forces as well. But I hope you've enjoyed. See you all again. Goodbye.